welcome and good morning in today's class we will see the working of the face transform to submit this circuit go to the library <coughs> the first component we require is source in this circuit instead of using a three phase ac source we will use three single phase ac voltage source the next thing we require is transformer three phase transformer that is present in your element library go to element library and you are here you are having three phase two winding transform add this to our cell the next thing we need is load next we need ground go back to <coughs> measurement we need voltage measurement current measurement display we need scope we need display then mux the last component is power gate now let us go to our window and let us arrange the component accordingly now this source three phase source three single phase source next three phase transformer then you need three phase load this is our three phase load now let us connect it you can rotate the component by using controller by using three single phase sources i am creating and three phase supply by using three single phase sources i am creating and three phase supply now the neutral is common for all the source now this is r y p now let us assign the value for r y and b for example now assigning the assigning the value as 440 r phase the phase angle is 0 and frequency is 50 next r phase y phase here the value is 440 phase angle is plus 120 frequency is 50 next b phase 440 minus 120 frequency 50 next let us connect the current machines like that like in single phase transformer in three phase transformer you have two sides primary side and secondary side primary is connected to the source secondary is connected to our three phase load
now we need three voltage measurement to measure the voltage across individual phases to measure the voltage across individual phases the voltmeter is connected across one end of the voltmeter is connected to the phase and other end is grounded now this voltmeter will give you phase voltage like it likewise you do for the second this ammeter one end is connected to phase another end is connected to the ground next is current measurement you need three current measurement for each phase now again on secondary side we need to have three voltage measurement and three current measurement and all other things are routed next max max the input to your max is three signal output signal output from your max is or a single out here we need the input should be 3 as we are having three measurement input should be 3 but here it is one. to change it double click it and apply the value as 3 as we are having 1 2 3 4 four measurement you need four marks now we need to connect three voltage measurement similar to our primary one of the voltmeter is connected to the phase other end is connected to the total one end to the phase other end to the total one end to the phase other end to the neutral now we need four mux for primary voltage primary current secondary voltage and secondary and we need two scope one for primary side other for secondary side and your scope should have two input go to file number of input 
one is primary voltage number two is primary voltage secondary current next primary voltage primary current also the input should be to the double gate port to input Now go to the transformer and assign the value for your transformer. You can assign any value. Here is the example. I am assigning the value as 440 and here assigning is uh, leaving it as 350. Now you can see that it will give you an error because the bracket is missing. When you are entering the value you may unknowingly delete the bracket. If you put the bracket again, it will not give you an error. So if it gives an error, check whether you are having your bracket over here or not. Last thing is, let us know, let us assign the value for load. Now, this is our prime secondary voltage, secondary current, and this is our primary voltage and primary current. Now, you can see that the difference is you are having three phase, and hence input is three phase, and again output is three phase. Each phase is having a phase displacement of 120 degree. And hence it is called as three phase transformer. The reason why we are moving from single phase to three phase is power delivery. And the other thing is from three phase transformer we can get single phase supply. Thank you.